In general, drivers navigate from a task, but it's also possible to manually enter a destination. Go to navigation in the main menu. Tap the search button to enter a destination. If you want to navigate to a new destination, select address. Enter a city or postal code and a street name. When you start typing, names of towns or cities that match with what you've entered will be displayed. Just tap the name to set the address. You also have the possibility to enter a house number or you can continue without entering one. Here we will continue without a house number. It's possible that the navigation finds multiple addresses. In that case, select which one you want to navigate to on the map and click on continue. The navigation will now calculate the route. You see that it takes us 1 hour and 2 minutes, it's 74 kilometers, there is no traffic delay and there are two different route options. If you select plan on top, you can add stops to your route in case you have to pass somewhere else on the way. If you tap somewhere in the grey area on the right side, you can see the directions without a map. Tap the arrow down to hide the directions. Now tap the green arrow to start the navigation. On the right side of the map you see the traffic bar. This bar indicates if there is any traffic on your way. And it displays how much traffic there is. In this case we don't have any traffic. The bar will be red when there is a heavy delay and yellow when there is a small delay. You can also see the distance and ETA. If you tap on these, you can change what kind of information you want displayed. For example, you want to display your speed instead of the distance. Select speed and click the cross to save. To stop the navigation, tap the menu button and select clear stop. Tap on cancel route to confirm. When you tap the search button, you can select your home address, work address or other favorites on top. To edit your favorites, tap the favorites button. Then tap on the edit button and select which address you want to edit. For example, you want to rename work to your company's name. So here I will name it Trimble. Delete the current name and enter the new name. Tap on the arrow to save. If we now go one step back, you can tap the plus button to add a new favorite. If we go back to the main menu, in the middle you can see your recent destinations. If you tap on more recents, you get a longer list of recent destinations. If you scroll down, under your recent destinations, you can find points of interest. These are for example gas stations, truck services, etc. If you tap the dots, you can find additional POIs. If you want to navigate to one of your contacts, you can tap on contacts. If you have coordinates, tap on coordinates and enter your values. To change your navigation settings, tap on the menu button and select settings. You get an overview of all the settings and just select the one you want to edit.